The cosmos may appear to us as a static expanse, where nothing happens for hundreds of light years. However, this impression is deceptive. Scientists from the Gemini Observatory in Hawaii have captured a unique photograph of a distant galaxy formed through the merger of two spiral galaxies a billion years ago. They believe that, in a few billion years, our Milky Way and its neighbor, the Andromeda Galaxy, will also collide and merge into a single elliptical galaxy, which astronomers have named Milkamida. At the moment, the distance between the Milky Way and the Andromeda Galaxy is two and a half million light years. However, these galaxies are moving towards each other and are likely to collide in about four billion years, merging into a single entity. The first mention of the Andromeda Galaxy dates back to the year 964 AD when Persian astronomer Abd al-Rahman al-Sufi published a book on fixed stars. In it, he named Andromeda and also noted the position of the Large Magellanic Cloud, a much smaller galaxy that is a satellite of our Milky Way. Thanks to the Hubble Space Telescope, we have been able to detect galaxies closest to us, determine their sizes, and even establish their positions relative to our world. It's hard to imagine, but just about a century ago, scientists believed that our Milky Way was the entire universe. The group to which our Milky Way belongs includes 40 galaxies. In the space between galaxies, one can also observe a vast number of dwarf galaxies, typically satellites of more massive objects like our galaxy or Andromeda. Andromeda surpasses the Milky Way in mass, size, and the number of stars. These two galaxies are approaching each other, and as a result of their collision in about four billion years, a massive galaxy called Milkomeda will form. Despite the overall increase in distance between galaxies in the expanding universe, gravity continues to play a role in their mutual approach. Gravitational interactions on cosmic scales influence the rate of the universe's expansion. There is a competition between the initial expansion speed after the Big Bang and the gravitational effects of various forms of energy in the universe. Different theories suggest different scenarios ongoing expansion, slowing due to gravity, or even a balance between expansion and gravity. Dark energy also plays a key role in the accelerated expansion of the universe. Astrophysicists believe that the universe will constantly expand, creating more empty space. Instead of uniform expansion, the universe has a complex structure with galaxies, clusters, and cosmic voids. This structure resembles a web where galaxies form along threads, connecting at nodes. Dense regions of space attract matter and contribute to the formation of star clusters and galaxies, while less dense areas may give away their matter to dense regions, leading to the formation of cosmic voids. All these processes adhere to the laws of gravity and the expansion of the universe, determining the dynamics of the cosmic structure's evolution. Although galaxies, including the Milky Way and Andromeda, will collide and merge within the local group over tens of billions of years, the local group itself will never merge with other galaxy clusters. The universe is like an ocean where individual galaxy groups are akin to islands, constantly drifting away from each other in the vast cosmic sea. So, what does this upcoming event hold for us Earthlings? It can be confidently stated that in four billion years, the solar system will face its own challenges, much more severe than the approaching Andromeda. As the sun transforms into a red giant, it will heat up to the point where Earth loses its atmosphere and water envelope, eventually being entirely engulfed by the sun. By that time, we may have to relocate to the outskirts of the solar system and witness the great galactic collision. When encountering Andromeda, the merging process will occur very slowly and likely go unnoticed to observers.
As they begin to interact, stars will be torn from each other, stretching into long tails. If observed from Earth, the night sky will gradually reveal the Andromeda galaxy during this collision. In galactic collisions, larger galaxies absorb smaller ones, tearing them apart and taking their stars. However, when galaxies are similar in size, like the Milky Way and Andromeda, the merger completely disrupts their spiral structures. Eventually, two groups of stars will form a giant elliptical galaxy. No catastrophic consequences are expected from the collision. Stars are so sparsely scattered in space that collisions between them are almost inevitable. The calm movement of interstellar gases will be disrupted, increasing the frequency of their collisions and, consequently, the intensity of forming new generations of stars. It can be said that from two aging galaxies, an updated Milkalmeda will emerge. As inhabitants of the planetary system, we are naturally concerned about the fate of planets. Even if we find a new planetary system around one of the nearest stars, it would be reassuring to be certain that our new cosmic home won't lose stability due to the galactic collision. Calculations show that this can be ensured with a high degree of probability. Our sun will also remain on the periphery, but it's not ruled out that during the collision, the solar system might be entirely ejected by gravitational forces and become a wandering intergalactic object. However, the probability of such an ejection from the Milky Way during the first galaxy collision is 12%. There is also a 3% chance that the solar system will move into the Andromeda galaxy. The central area of the merged galaxy, where two giant black holes will collide, our own and an even more massive one at the center of Andromeda, will be of particular interest. Shortly before the black holes collide, they will emit gravitational waves with a power of 10 quintillion solar masses. Researchers believe that any civilization within 3 million light-years from us, equipped with gravitational wave detection technology, will be able to detect the collision. Despite such an outcome being just one of the possible scenarios, it's essential to remember that galactic collisions are a common process. For instance, the Andromeda Nebulae have already collided in the past, at least with one dwarf galaxy. By the time the presumed galactic collision occurs, humanity will likely be at an entirely different stage of development. It's possible that such processes may no longer pose any threat to us, or perhaps our species may not even survive until that moment. Predictions can vary, but human advancement is happening at an enormous pace. Today, it's challenging to envision the technologies we will possess in hundreds of years. Perhaps by then, we'll be able to freely travel between galaxies and no one will seriously contemplate the imminent end of our era. If, like us, you are fascinated by the mysteries of the cosmos, don't forget to support our channel. Give a like to this video, share it with your friends, and of course, subscribe to our channel to not miss out on new captivating stories about space.